Zu Limpopo is uh, the youngest zoo in Ukraine. It's private zoo and it's located approximately in the mid middle way between Lviv city and Truskovet city, well known resort. So this is uh, the turning to the zoo. Uh, okay, <laughs> the approaching way is not very fashion and initially a lot of tourists can think, ah, nothing interesting here. But believe me, uh, the zoo itself is worth your attention. <coughs> so this is the central entrance, yeah, the, the map of the zoo. Friendly speaking, uh, the total area is not big, it's uh, approximately 8 uh, football fields. <laughs> But uh, because uh, the zoo was established only in 2010 and because this is a private zoo and uh, no, frankly speaking, inside no any free place. I mean, the zoo is very compact, cells to cells uh, and uh, no any park. Some people find it negative, but I found it positive because you don't need to walk a lot of and uh, all the animals are located in one uh, small place. <laughs> yeah. So uh, what you can uh, what you can see inside. Yeah. First of all, uh, in the zoo there are a lot of uh, sculptural compositions like this one <coughs> or like this one. I mean uh, the. The command of designers, uh, they did very perfect work <laughs> here, <laughs> believe me. This is uh, old Soviet uh, car <laughs> and uh, I think it's like amusement place for baboons, yeah, for monkeys. Uh, the video was made in January and, ah, by the way, uh, all these baboons, you can find all the information, they, all of them, they have names, sometimes they are fighting like here, <laughs> yeah. uh, because you see this tube and uh, visitors put in the tube some, I don't know, sweets, fruits, <laughs> and this is their favorite place, and for example, this, this is a mother with a baby monkey baby yeah. <laughs> and she's fighting with another uh, monkeys <laughs> for this place near the pipe but as the video was made in january not so many visitors and uh, not so many sweets of course yeah uh, but uh, as i said it's winter uh, but uh, we all know that the climate uh, has <laughs> has changed warming effect yes and uh, no snow, uh, maybe it's uh, negative, but uh, for such tropical animals, uh, positive. Why? Because you know, uh, all of them, especially tropical animals, they feel themselves uh, very good in uh, summer cells. Yeah, because uh, also they have some. Uh, winter cells, winter premises uh, for animals but you know because uh, heating is very expensive now and uh, this, uh, as this zoo is private uh, they should uh, spend a lot of money for heating system and now they, because of warm winter they save a lot of money I think. Okay, so also in the zoo we, uh, there are a lot of such home animals, local animals like the squirrels. Uh, yes, yeah, so we saw a lot of them in the parks, but here we can see in the, in the squirrel, the nearest system. Very big collection of cats, different cats. Uh, yes, like this family. <laughs> um, again, some sculptures. A lot of places for very nice photos. Yeah. Very simple, very simple, as you see, nothing special, but it's nice. Very good comment on designers. Uh, by Tiger, yeah. <laughs> Not every zoo uh, can proud of uh, such animal. Oh, God. 
left. <laughs> Just see this very gracious cat. Puma, yeah. Also another cat. <laughs> very nice. Leopard. Um, it was a very angry animal. It showed us his teeth. Yeah. Uh, very strong teeth. It was very angry. I don't know why. <laughs> Maybe we spoil his uh, after lunch sleeping. <laughs> Dreams. I don't know what he dreamt about. Black Panther. Yeah. A Camelion <coughs> bear. <coughs> I don't know. Usually in winter uh, he should sleep, yes. <laughs> but this one uh, doesn't sleep. I don't know why. Maybe in Himalayan mountains uh, they don't sleep at winter time. <laughs> I don't know. I'm not a biologist. <laughs> Polar bay, uh, polar wolves. We'll meet them a little bit lately. And again, leopard, leopard. As you see, the area of cells uh, are rather big enough. This is wife and husband. <laughs> yes. You come from the west side. These birds are preparing for spring marriage side. dancing. <laughs> I think this male right is brain. training now <laughs> for such dancing. <laughs> me Again, several. As you see, uh, the floor is uh, rather clean and don't it fry, means uh, fry, not any disgusting fry. smells. Your I checked, believe me. In the zoo there are some ponds, for example, the, uh, these two ones are the biggest, yeah, flamingo, I think I'm first time uh, when I see a flamingo in winter, in January I see flamingo outside of the winter <laughs> premises, yeah, and uh, left pond is there are cells over to protect any uh, birds to fly out, but this uh, pond is open area, and I think uh, these ducks are a local one. Maybe black swans also, <laughs> because they can fly out. But why? <laughs> ah, polar uh, wolves. Yeah, they should be absolutely white, but because absence of, of absence of snow, <laughs> yes, they are gray, <laughs> gray polar wolves, <laughs> not white ones. Surian tiger or Siberian tiger. Uh, also, there are three ones, <laughs> three animals. But I regret during my visit, all of them slept and were sleeping. <laughs> One more pond is local ducks <laughs> and 
some swarms swarms yeah crow yeah very <coughs> Where I saw them, I think, and sometimes you even hear its uh, sounds. Moment. And this bird is very wise bird because they can live during 300 years, as far as I know. So, uh, also very nice family of wild lions, one male and two females. Also, not every zoo can be proud of such family. So, uh, we are going to finish our short tour in the Papua Zoo uh, for uh, foreigners how to reach uh, the zoo from Lviv. Yeah, <laughs> because most foreigners are staying in Lviv city. Uh, okay, first, uh, okay, by taxi, but it's rather expensive. <laughs> uh, I don't know how much, but expensive. Also, you can use public buses. Uh, uh, every buses, every bus uh, which moves uh, from Lviv to Truskovets city or Drogobol city go uh, via Medenici village. And not exactly by the zoo, but uh, you can uh, how to say from you you need to work maybe approximately six or seven hundred meters not so very big distance from the village itself um, uh, and uh, yes at opposite side uh, you can also walk uh, to the center of Medenici and to turn left uh, you can need you can walk approximately one kilometer and there is a bus stop in the center of the village also there are a lot of a lot of transit buses from Drogobic and from Truskave city to the Lviv so and the price maybe three euro <laughs> uh, from Lviv to Medenic and back uh, so it's but by taxi you need to spend maybe 100 euros maybe more